we feel entitled to artificially inseminate a cow. And when she gives birth, we steal her baby. Even though her cries of anguish are unmistakable. And then we take her milk that's intended for her calf and we put it in our coffee and our cereal. I don't need really any science to, to see with my own eyes and hear how an animal responds to, to pain, right? That's undeniable. You what if I tell you, here, an animal will perish in less than 60 seconds? It has to. Less than 60 seconds. That is the most humane, humane harvest process in the country. You are the only one that you know of that has a process that you have. So that means a majority of them don't have that. And it's not only just the death, the process leading up to that death. Oh, raising right? it. Raising it, the transportation, the separation so from the animal, family. And, yes, mm -hmm. 100%. Anytime a calf is born on my property, I refuse to take the mother away from its baby because I won't do it. Weren't those whole scenes that we saw in the other pen next to the mother? Those were, those were bought out of an auction and they were healthy. And you were, I'm glad you got to visualize it. And you've seen that there were no downers, no three-leggers, no hot. I don't believe in that. Mm -hmm. I will not use that protocol uh, to buy them cheaper to profit monetarily. I don't need it. Mm -hmm. That's not my thing. Because they no longer were being used Any as, as dairy. Any animal that's here is, is, is being... used for consumption. Uh -huh. that's, that's the slaughterhouse business. Right. Those were used for milking that they did were. not produce enough milk anymore I see. for whatever reason. So then they were here to be harvested, murdered, harvested, murdered, harvested, murdered, murdered. You have to understand my side, how I understand I, yours. I understand, but your know, language is powerful. So harvested, please. Murdered, okay. All right. <laughs> you say tomato, I say tomato. <laughs> you want to go get her? Yeah. Let's go get her. Mama and baby, and the baby's a girl. I talked to the vet here who said the baby is a girl. And I think that she was born probably about a week ago. And the slaughterhouse owner here, as we heard, does not kill mothers and babies.
part of our protocol here at Farm Sanctuary. We do a thing where, you know, at first they come in, we make sure that they don't have anything contagious, and they go in with everybody else. Then they can run in the hills and do what cows like to do. Oh my love. Right? Oh, isn't she beautiful? Oh my goodness. Oh my love. They're pretty, pretty good. There we go. All right. And then if you're, you good with that? Get under the stomach. I think, I think that's it. How that animal has been raised up until now, and it, it's going to take a transformation at the sanctuary to accomplish what you want. Yeah. Well, well, it's all good, man. Yeah. All right. Thank you so much. I'm going to send you some photos of this cow and the calf as they go out to the field. All right. See you later. All right. All right. Thank you. Thank you.